Hi, this is uh this is Jim Pellerino. Um there are supernatural things that exist. Um they've occurred in my life and um I'm I'm kind of aware of a, a lot of uh what's being done to me. My illnesses are all uh created via frequencies and electronic uh, electromagnetic frequencies. So when I was like um, uh, going through all that wretched pain, it was due to um, electromagnetic frequency manipulations. People that uh, are in charge of this sort of thing, and, and uh, we're, I think we're we're kind of talking about um, the military-industrial complex here. That that. Um, NASA sort of like uh, technology, maybe NASA, um, and a, a criminality that um, that attacked me with electromagnetic frequency. It just two days ago, uh, I started feel uh, I felt this sickness, and I knew it was due to this to people like uh, in control of these uh, machines. Like like Harp is one of these sorts of machines, right? Um, uh, that can um, that can manipulate frequency with pinpoint accuracy upon someone and get them ill. Uh, someone can um, can shoot like a, a certain electromagnetic frequency at at like uh, someone such as like Andrew Breitbart, right? And um, and and you won't be able to see the um, uh, the frequency that's hitting him. It's not in the visible light spectrum, by the way. And um, mess up his autonomic responses, and have his heart go like this, and have the have like uh, someone like such as Andrew Breitbart uh, have a heart attack without any trace whatsoever in the coroner's report of like e like something as intricate as was like a uh, poisoning or anything like that. I mean, there's there's just no I don't know there, there's no signature traditional signature of like oh yeah he was assassinated or. It was all done with electromagnetic frequency. This is a technology that um, that uh, are in the hands of some people. It's it's like it's and they use it and they've used it upon me. And um, it, like I said, two days ago it was it occurred and then like then the frequency changed up and all of a sudden it was, and I could hear this one was in the audible range. I could hear it, boom. Uh, uh, just like that, in a matter of a fraction of a second, I got big ears. I guess maybe it helps me in this matter. I I don't think so, but um, I could hear the frequency change up, and then I started feeling health uh, healthier again. I mean, really healthy, just like that. And and this is the technology that everyone had that uh, that people have. This is how it's done. If you have a cell phone on you. Um, they're gonna know where you are, uh, like anywhere on the earth. It doesn't matter. You have a cell phone on you. They're gonna know where you are, and they can beam the frequency at you and kill you if they if they so desired. Now, I I don't um. I don't like hate technology. It, it's erroneous to say uh, the technology is to blame for this, but people having like people just the the technology being in the knowledge being occulted in the and in the hands of just a few people um, is going to lead to some like very devastating consequences and and um, uh, a, a ruling like uh, criminality mindset. That that's going to come over um, the people that do have the technology and the capabilities of doing this, um, and and uh, the best the the you can't really you can't say no to the technology if it's there, but um, yeah, if 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 the knowledge and in the hands the technology is in the hands of everyone where everyone can see what's going on that the the transparency issue is is um is what's needed 
we need uh, transparency on these sorts of things in order to um, to prevent uh, criminal actions from from uh, from occurring. The people need the information and need the transparency, the regular common citizen, to prevent these sorts of bad things because it is a deterrent. If people know, this makes a deterrent and makes it less apt to occur. And th there should be like uh, sites devoted to this without any lies. Like Dutch Sense was lying quite a bit, right? On the internet. And uh, there's like suspicious observers. I, uh, uh, yeah, I'm extremely suspicious of um, someone from the Levi sect saying anything whatsoever. You look at the old Judaic law in Leviticus, it seems like the criminals are the ones that wrote the laws. Kind of sounds like what we have now here in our government. Have a nice day.